Sharks, I'm Danielle Lang. And I'm David Joheim. On today's show, we get a behind the scenes look on our WSRK movie reviews. Next will be a feature on the toy drive, and we'll follow our sharks through the WPVT news station. This and more on WSRK Shark, Shark News. news. Every week, I look forward to seeing what movie will be reviewed on Spoiled Broccoli. Well, actually, this week we got a special interview with Ethan Toth himself on what it's like to create his reviews. Let's take a look! The Stubmasters are a group of friends, these are my friends, uh, that have congregated on YouTube to specialize in movie reviews and movie news and just talking about movies in general because we love it. Uh, and it's comprised of myself, uh, my friend John, and my other friend Jonathan. Being a stub master, is, I'm mostly talent. Uh, I'm the one that goes see the movie. Goes to see the movie. I'm the one that has to formulate an opinion. I have to write my review. Um, I have to, uh, you know, set up some equipment and stuff. And I sit down and I talk about it with the other guys. Um, I'm not the main editor. That's Jonathan's job. Um, but occasionally, when I have a special project, I will work on that myself. There are a few videos that I've edited myself on the channel, and uh, I try to put my own little little spin on them. Uh, the inspiration behind it uh, wasn't actually me. I didn't start it. Uh, it was my friend Jonathan that started it. Um, he loved movies for a long time, and that's where we based a lot of our friendship off of, and one day he came up to me and he asked, you know, Ethan, I, I started this channel. Do you want a part of it? Um, and of course I said yes, because I love movies, he loves movies, my friends love movies, and we wanted to talk about them together. Uh, the future endeavors of the Submasters are, I always wanted to take it into a more uh, journalism, uh, a, a route for journalism more. Um, I wanted to actually cover news uh, as well as the regular movie reviews, uh, so that's kind of where I want to take it into a more uh, journalist route. Um, I think the channel has impacted others because it might not seem so, but we want to create a... Um, a place for people to come together, a sort of a community to come together um, to talk about things we love, and what we love is movies, so I wanted to create a community where people can come together, whether it be in the comments or on our Twitter or um, you know all our social media sites, uh, to come together, to talk about movies, to get in contact with us, because we like talking about movies, and we want to talk to our fans and talk to our audience. Uh, so I think it's really brought people together, is what I'm getting at. So I'd like to say, well, guys, you can check out the channel on www.youtube.com forward slash the uh, Stubmasters. You can check us out there. You can also check out uh, some merch on www.cafepress.com forward slash Stubmasters where you can get uh, t-shirts uh, like this one. Uh, uh, yeah, I hid it from you guys again, so I pulled the surprise. You can get t-shirts like this on cafepress.com forward slash Stubmasters. And, uh, you know, this has been a great interview. And I'll see you guys later. Okay. Bye. and unfortunately some families aren't able to provide gifts for their children. The Tri Music Honor Society held a toy drive to help those underprivileged kids have a happy holiday. For the Tri Music Honor Society, we're doing a holiday toy drive until December 19th for, uh, for non-profit child organizations. We're doing one toy per hour, um, but students who bring three toys or more get three toys per hour. That's also with books and stuff like that. So new, unwrapped, fresh toys and books. That's it makes me happy that I'm able to help students to feed families. Well, me being the advisor for the Tribe Music Honor Society, uh, this gives my students an opportunity to give back to uh, the less fortunate, uh, to be able to express themselves and uh, just give back to the community uh, overall. So since we haven't even uh, chosen an organization quite yet, we're going to try um, shooting for underprivileged kids who don't have the opportunity to get books and toys and things like that during the holiday season, so that's just for them to have a happier holiday. Bring toys to Mr. Virgil's band room, room 158. Last day to donate is Monday, December 19th.
This is Juan Munoz from WSRK Shark News. Come on, we got a show to start. 40 seconds. In turn, mic me up. Let's go. Clip it on. Let's go. Let's go. Where is my script? I wanted it five minutes ago. Give it to me. Come on. Well, where's my flip cereal? Huh? I want it on my desk. Come on. Come on. Give it to me. Let's go. Let's go. We got a show. Now that's better. Available in two flavors, chocolate and dulce de leche. Visit flipsusa.com to see where Flips is available near you. Flips, the best is inside. Hey you. Me? Yeah, you. I have something to tell you. You do? Yeah. Well, what is it? What is it? Well, why didn't you just say so? I think you should join the Sharks Television and Entertainment Club, where many students just like you can make all kinds of videos. Not to mention, we've also won several awards and plan to keep them coming. And the best part is, we sell bagels. Whoa, bagels? Yeah. Bagels. So what do you say? Yeah! Sharks TV and Entertainment, for a televised tomorrow. Last week, I, along with a few of our other sharks, got a chance to visit our local PBS station, WPBT. They were able to watch a live recording and take a tour of the studio. Here's a recap on our experience. WSRK got a chance to visit WPBT today to look at a live taping. We got a behind-the-scenes look of what it's like to work in this field. Just down the streets from ATM, WPPT Studios let us watch a live recording of Issues, a show currently in production. We got a chance to catch up with Henry Mack, the host of the program, to hear his thoughts on the future of journalism. Uh, this generation, I think, will affect communications greatly, especially because the old mode of communication is out. Print journalism, print this, print that, is sort of falling by the wayside. What we're witnessing now is a resurgence, or rather uh, an emerging of new media forms of communication. Innovative platforms, Web 2.0, virtual reality technology, uh, innovative and new methods of blogging. Uh, and this is, this is really the, way, the, new, the future of communication itself. Hopefully in a few years, you'll see videos just like this on your local news. For WSOK, I'm Danielle Link reporting. That's it for this week. I'm David Johan. And I'm Danielle Link for WSRK Shark News.
That's it for this week, sharks. 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 That's it for this. That's it for this week, sharks. That's it for this week, sharks. I'm David Johan. And I'm Danielle Link. Let's do this again. <laughs> That's, That's it for it. this week, Sharks. That's it for this week, Sharks. That's it for this week, Sharks. That's it for this week, Sharks. I'm David Johan. And I'm Danielle Link for WSRK Shark News. <laughs> That's it for this week, Sharks. I'm David Johan. And I'm Danielle Link from WSRK Shark News. Oh, yeah. I didn't look at the camera. That's it for this week, Sharks. That's it for this week, Sharks. Okay, you keep changing the tone. Okay. That's it for this week, Sharks. That's it for this week. Okay, sharks, that's... Or say that's it for this week. I'm David Johan, you don't have to say sharks. Why not? That's it for this week, sharks. No. That's it for this week, sharks. I'm David Johan. And I'm Danielle Link. That's it for this week. I'm David Johan. And I'm Danielle Link for WSRK Shark News. Whoa, bagels! <laughs> <laughs>